Hey guys, welcome back to Zelda 64 Nightmare, the first ROM hack that was ever released for Ocarina of Time, as far as I'm aware. Um, the last episode we did Dodongo's Cavern. It took us the whole freaking episode to get through there. Um, so now we're headed to the top of Death Mountain to see if we can find the Great Fairy and maybe get some magic power while avoiding these Gways, which are assaulting me. Um, so yeah, let's check it out. This has so far been an extremely difficult ROM hack. Um, so let's see if we can, can we back walk and outrun these things? Yes. We don't need no stinking Hylian shield. Let's be careful here. Nice. Um, we don't have a slingshot. That's going to be a problem. Unless we can sneak past these guys. Now, what's interesting is, is that back in Dodongo's Cavern, um, there was a eye switch behind a crate. Well, that already worked out in my favor. An eye switch behind the one crate in the room, but we don't have a slingshot, so I don't know. Need to find a slingshot. Maybe we have to go back there at some point or something? I don't know, but let's check it out. Huge shout out to my members that belong to the channel. If you want to join and support the channel in another way besides views, then make sure you stop in the membership area and choose the tier that you want. Tier is going to change. Oh, we don't have Zelda's lullaby yet. Never mind. Yeah, if you uh, want to become a member, you know, support the channel a little bit more than just views, and, you know, then join it if you want. I'll give you guys shout outs. Priority reply to comments. I'm not sure, like, what other perks I would do for that because, it, like I said, it needs to be something that I'd be able to consistently do and not fall behind on because then it'd be like, you know, oh, why am I even joining the channel if I don't get the benefits, you know, that come with it? Oh my god, this is really bad. Um, hmm. Gwaze and, okay, um, 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 I don't know if I want to be in here. Yikes. So we don't have Zelda's lullaby. We can't uh, do the fairies, even though he told me. And there's no owl up here to take me down either. That's kind of annoying. Um, all right, so now we need to go back down because I save stated and I thought that I was going to be able to do something up here, but I couldn't because I'm used to having Zelda's lullaby by the time I'm up here, but that's obviously not going to happen. All right, let's line ourselves up here so we can back walk out of here. No problem. Oh my God. Please let this be okay. Please let this be okay. Ah! Uh, I took one hit. Whatever. <clears throat> okay, so we have bombs. Oh, it's still shaking. Why? <laughs> let me go. Okay. We should probably go back in Goron City. I wonder if the Gorons are there now. You know what? Is this something good? or is This is usually a rupee, isn't it? I think it is. Be nice if it was a piece of heart. It's Ruby. All right. So I wonder if the Gorons are back in Goron City now that they're now that I completed Dorango's Cavern. You know what? I can get hearts out of these things, can I? We don't usually like drop all hearts. Yes. Nice. I could also go back and there was that grotto that had. Oh, they are not back. Okay, so. Now this area is usually, I think, Metagoron. Oh, wow. Oh. Other layer? That's usually money. Five or six years. All right, so that's vanilla. Vanilla. Um, so we can go to the boulder maze. See what lies in there. Usually it's a spider and it's not usually a piece of heart, is it? Just money? Let's just bust this up so we don't have to do the tightrope every time. So we have access to Zora's river now. Um, I wonder if we can get all the silver rupees in CAC now that we have the... We should go this way first, right? Um, now that we have the bombs for the boulder. If we have Deku Shield, we could start uh, super sliding into places if we need to. 
Shut up! I know you know can't help me, so I know you know. I know that you don't know how you can help me. That's why I uh, don't want to talk to you. Couldn't speak for a minute. Words were not a uh, thing. Alright, this is probably just money. Useless money! Useless money again! Alright, just be careful not to get hit by the. Can still get the gold scooter. Now, the spider house is locked behind red ice, which is interesting. So we can't even, I mean, we haven't gotten that many gold scooters to begin with. Only, we've only gotten like, what, three, I think? Yeah. So we can't even start turning in those things until we find some way to melt the red ice. I think we're done in here for now. I'm trying to think. Lost Woods. There was nothing. I mean, there's boulders to break there, but I really want to go back to Kakariko and bomb the boulder that I think is hiding the last silver rupee there that we couldn't get in the last episode. Let's see. We have five bombs left. Full hearts. Four hearts now, which is good. There was nothing above Dodongo's Cavern, which is disappointing. I was kind of hoping to find another heart piece there to... Uh, fill out another container, which would be nice, but that's okay. We have four to work with now, which is better than three. Whee. Now in here, is this the same? Bird. Uh, oh, oh, blue fire. Huh. That's interesting. Oh my God. Why do I still get hurt by him? Also, very disappointed in the lack of Deku Nuts um, supply. All right, what's behind this boulder? I'll bet it's the last silver rupee. Yep. One. Now, Kakariko at nighttime had the Kokiri sword, and you couldn't come in via the uh, Death Mountain Trail, or else it would. The dark magic would soft lock you. Which is pretty crazy. So bottle is going to be on our agenda because that's blue fire, which means that there's probably something important hidden inside the spider house. Now the Goron says the living dead is in there, so I don't know what that means. Who the heck knows? Hey, just in time. No, you don't. No, you don't. Out of the way. Thank you. Ah! Uh, actually hang off the edge when it pushes you like that. <laughs> Interesting. We don't have a way to melt that web yet, either. So what does this do if we get all of the... Uh, oh, duh. <laughs> I was just talking about it. The web. All right, so we can go to the graveyard now. What does that allow us to do? We haven't opened the gate to Hyrule Castle yet, either. It's really much dick. Alright, so what, what's going to be important in the graveyard? More money. Is that going to be a fake one? I feel like it's going to be fake. Doesn't matter. I'm full on money anyway. I don't want to risk it. Graveyard with Gwaze. Interesting. Maybe we'll find that bottle here. Oh, we can't. My god. Dude, they like took half my health off. So we can't move these during the day. So that means it needs to be somehow night here. Hmm. We don't have Zelda's lullaby. Hmm. So yeah, kid is a problem because we can't move the gravestones during the day. So how would we get here at night is what I want to know. And is there anything, I don't think there's anything else we can do with a torch here. Hmm. So we need a bottle. 
We also need more bombs. Oops, didn't mean to do that. I have some health back, which is good. Can we get bombs out of the uh, bushes here? Be nice if we could. Of course not, right? So we do have access to Zora's River. I wonder if we need to go there next. Some bombs? Anybody? Man, stingy on the bombs. Oh, hello. So we don't have efficient way to kill those yet. Does this guy still sell just magic beans? And we're not going to be able to open the Zora's Waterfall either because... Um, let's just buy one for now. be nice if we get a piece of heart here. That would be good. Fill in a container. Yeah, we're not going to be able to open the Waterfall if it requires Zelda's Alibi. Although we could use a chicken and glitch in there, but then there's a sequence breaking and then... Oh, we got the infinite spitting Octorox. That's just great. It's super dark here, too. I can't see for crap. There is a heart piece there, which is good. I want that. Thing is, can we drop the chicken temporarily and still keep it? Gimme. Give Gimme give the chicken, chicken, chicken. Oh my god, really? I really wanted to save the chicken so I didn't have to go back to the beginning and get it, but I guess not. Yeah, let's just take a peek. Oh wait, that didn't complete another arc container though. Oh, that was number three. Huh. I don't know why I thought I had like three. I can't count. That's probably why. And neutral B is really disorienting and rocks there. That's different. Everything's a mess. There's a scooter down there, though. Another heart piece. Uh, I kind of want to kill a spider before it becomes daytime. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Nice. That's number four on the token menu. All right, so if we wanted to get into here, I do want to get that last heart piece. I guess we got to go back because... We also haven't been to Lake Hylia or even tried Gerudo Valley yet either. Could be worth looking at. But we gotta go all the way back to the friggin' beginning because... Chicken. Don't get hit by the jellies! <clears throat> that would be bad. This. Give it. Oh, that was such a bad idea. Bring it around. Don't get jellied. Because that would be bad. Um, excuse me. Where'd the chicken go? It took my chicken. What the frick was that? Um, not cool. Oh, 
All right, so let me save state right here and see what the deal is with. So is this steal your chicken if you walk across the threshold like that to stop you from cheating? Bro. Why does that happen? Can I like fool it by, oh! Wow, so they literally programmed it so you can't take the chicken over and cheat behind the waterfall. Dude, that is hilarious actually that they eliminated cheating there huh okay well i see how it is i only have one bomb left too so let's go towards gerudo and see what happens oh this looks bad and it's dawn again hey a heart see ice bats trees in gerudo valley like what oh my favorite enemy like likes oh my god freezers um no chicken bridges up no gerudos all right can we uh eat is there still a piece of heart behind the waterfall Still got a ladder. Hey! Yes! Another heart container. Thank you so much. Nice. We have five hearts now. That should help a little bit. I'm glad I came this way. No Gerudo. Are you like Hylia? We got some ice bats. That's. Oh! There's a bottle over there. <gasps> Dude, is that Rudo's bottle or is that just an empty bottle? Oh, wow. Okay, so I could have come here and got that bottle since the beginning. And now we can scoop blue fire and fairies, which is going to be so helpful. Wow, I should have come here earlier. You don't really think to go to Lake Hylia earlier than... Or at all as child link, really. Huh. I wonder if I can farm some bombs here. Usually that's the, this is the best spot to get some bombs. But, uh, my hopes are quickly being shot down. So we can get blue fire from Death Mountain Trail now and get inside the spider house. Dude, really? No, there we go. Oh, there's another piece of heart up there. And I have lobs too, nice. Hmm. Wonder how I get that. I can't see for crap. Alright, let's uh Whoa, I cannot see. I cannot see. At all. I was gonna follow the map. Alright, back in Hyrule Field. Let's go back to You know what? Is there still a Deku down here that would sell me like a piece of heart or something? Nice. All right, we're starting another heart container. All right, so yeah, definitely um, getting the vanilla heart piece spots is going to be a good thing to do because stuff in this place hurts. We should go get another Deku shield from Kokiri real quick. Nice. We still don't know how to open that. You know what? I wonder if they hid something up above on that little alcove. There's also all these houses that are uh, blocked up with boulders, so I don't know if that'll have anything to do with it as well. Make sure there's nothing else I can do in here with bombs now that I'm back. The sword grove, was that blocked by a red boulder or a regular boulder? It's blocked by a red boulder. Okay, so everything here is blocked by red boulders. All right, we got a deck of shield back. Let's go back to Kakariko.
I did that in the last episode too. I skipped across and fell. Alright, so this is nighttime cac. Is there no way to get to the graveyard at all through this? Probably not. Unless I can walk behind the flames. I can. I wonder if I could ground hop. I wonder. We did go get a Decker shield. Ooh, got it. All right, so if I start walking around here, can I get to the graveyard without getting borked at night? So far, nothing bad is happening. Oh, there's one of those dark magic signs. I'm gonna leave myself safe stated there in case I get soft locked by trying to come back in. But I'm in the graveyard at night. <laughs> I feel like I'm not supposed to be here yet. But we can pull the graves. The trick will be if we try and leave. That's where we're going to run into problems. Could grab a fairy from in here. Although we're going to need blue fire anyway. Alright, that's just money. The unmarked redead grave. We won't be able to get the piece of heart. If it still functions the same as vanilla. Um, we need sun song for that. This way. Good memory. Alright, so we need some song for that. Now, I'm concerned about what's going to happen when I try and leave the graveyard. I got in there, though. Ground hop for the win. Let's see what happens. Because there was one of those signs there that said, you know, it looked like it was going to say the same thing as the. Dark magic ahead, wait until morning to pass. <laughs> well, that's what happens when you try and break the game. <laughs> wow. Okay. Well, at least now we know what's over there. For now, just vanilla, it seems. And we don't have the Sun Song. We need Zelda's Lullaby to re really be able to do anything um, else besides. Um... So where do I want to go next? Oh yeah, um, I need to wait out. I need to do morning. We need to melt the red ice in front of the spider house. Because there was blue fire behind this thing. And red ice in front of that house. Beep. Thank you much. Love how they all just go down the hill slowly. <laughs> Follow the slope. Alright. To the spider house. See what's inside. Is it just going to be the vanilla spider house and we don't have enough spiders to get anything anyway or what? <sighs> Whoa. Okay. That is not what I was expecting. But the Goron did say the living dead is down, is in there. Oh my gosh. I'm having a uh, Zelda's birthday flashbacks. I say, does that work? Four hits because Kokiri sword, but whatever. Oh, well, this looks like it's gonna be an absolute joy. Let's um not have our Koki uh, Deku shield on just in case, because there's lots of these things to bomb. I'm gonna make sure we do all that. Good fire temple music. What? Don't trust any freestanding rupees. Got it. Oh. Okay. Ah. Oh. 
open the door, too. Okay. Convenient. Let's go this way. Huh, so all the invisible walls are gone. Which is interesting. Well, that does work against them. Nice. Alright, that worked. Yeah, all the invisible walls are gone. That's interesting, actually. I mean, it makes sense since we wouldn't have... Oh, wow. There's a switch down there. Yeah, we can't hit that until we drain the water somehow, which I imagine there's a different way to drain the water since we don't have Zelda's lullaby. So... Yeah. Alright, that one does have a chest in it and it's blocked. Can't see. Can't see. My god. Alright. We see oh nuttage, nice. It's been a while since we've gotten that. Um at least the guys here seem to do like normal damage and have normal HP. Um I feel like this is gonna be a locked door. Because it usually is. Oh, it's a barred door. Interesting. Usually that's a key door, isn't it? No idea. Save it. Concerned. What is that? Oh, is that an invisible, like... The heck? Floor master. Alright, can we hit this crystal switch with a bomb that's close enough to it? Can. Ah! Nice. Oh my gosh. Close space, don't like it, don't like it, don't like it at all. Nice. Okay. So that drained the water. That could have gone a lot worse with the uh <laughs> the floor masters. I switch. Why is it that torch and opens that door? Okay. Interesting. Wait, what did I just see? Almost. These guys are hard to hit. Oh my god. Why is there a switch just chilling in midair up there? <laughs> what the heck is that? All right, water's down, key door. Man, there's lots of these things, and I'm running out of bombs. That's not good. I'm concerned. Wow. Huh? Hmm. Now I'm out of bombs. Wonderful. Moving on. Well, we have access to the lower area at the entrance now because the water's down, so I guess we'll go that way. We also... do we have access to down below? We do, through there. I think that's the only access to down below that we've seen so far, to be honest. We do need more bombs, though, ASAP, because I feel like we're going to need them and I don't want to be stuck without them. Alright, so now we got this and a couple switch. What does that do? I have no idea. <laughs> There's one on the wall. That's weird. All right, what's this? This is usually dead hand. Okay, so it is dead hand. Um, can we get some bombs out of these? Just hearts. Okay. All right. So does dead hand work like... Um... Oh, is there a rupee in there? Get the double shot. Yes. 
nice. Oh, we have unlimited stick now. It's nice. Nice. Sick. So he wasn't really buffed at all, I don't think. Alright, what do we get for this? Big chest. Is it going to be an important item? Or is this going to be a stupid map or compass or some BS? I doubt it's... I don't think it's Lens of Truth. Oh, it's the freaking compass, man. Well, I don't want that. Well, the compass at least shows the chest. So we know that there's not a chest in this room. And I think... Yeah, I clipped the camera through the bottom there. And it looked like it was a... A blue rupee or something. I really would like some more bombs because... Lack of bombs is going to hold us back. Can these bushes even drop bombs, though? I feel like they can't. Yeah. Well, we just have to hope that we find bombs another way. Bombs away! So I have no idea what the, um, the crystal switch that I hit in here did, actually, now that I think about it. I imagine it did something, but what? I have no idea. I guess we gotta check all the spots that something might have happened. Bruh. Alright, against the wall is the best spot to hit these guys. If you could drop some bombs, I'd really appreciate it. Alright, that's still up. Did anything move? We do still have we do have access to the basement area still too. Alright, that's still up. Oh wow, I'm not completely over me. Is this still closed? Tis. Hmm. Of course. Hand thing still down there. That's still co oh, that's why there was a random switch floating in the air. Gotcha. I'm gonna take this guy out to stop him from potentially ruining my plans. That's a key door. Key door. Hmm. I actually kind of thought that might happen. What does this do? Oh, we opened some gates. Oh god, no. Alright. Alright, we have access to another large chest. Is this the map or something important? Key item? Please? Slingshot? Oh, I bet it's slingshot. Oh, it's the dungeon. Okay. Oh boy. Not good. Get wrecked. I feel like Slingshot's close, though, because we're seeing eye switches. Oh my god. That was lucky. Small chests? Did they change the... Oh no, it's still the same. Like, did they change the layout of the, uh, the visible path there? Or what? I was expecting that to be like a key or something. Whatever. Rule out all the chests. Who knows what's going to be in them. This is not an invisible thing. Right, we need a crate for that. There's a crate in here. But that's a death fall. Oh, hello. We cannot jump across this, I think. No. Wasn't quite ready to be down there yet. Um, hmm. So we need, oh, this is, we need bombs. We need to be able to hit that switch. Can we jump slash across this? Oh, it's close. I feel like it's possible actually. <gasps> yes. I have no idea if I should have done that or not, but... Huh. 
All right. Well, we still have a problem because... <laughs> I don't have a way to hit that switch. Because we don't have bombs. Oh, there's also a switch up there too. Wow, okay. Um, the thing is, can we get back? Oh god. Oh my gosh, yes, that was so good. Alright. Holy frick. <laughs> Get. I see you. Oh, I say comfort. Too close. What? All right. Anybody else? Didn't think so. Wow, is that really nothing? So a complete troll room. Why do I? Why am I not surprised? All right, we're we're in a bomb crisis right now. Oh, there's a little bit of a switch poking out there. Interesting. Hey, we have a bomb crisis. Um, unless there's a way to get. Yes. Okay, good. Okay. We need to time this to hit that crystal switch. I feel like I'm going to have a problem though because yeah, it's going to get hit by that. So can we do our fancy dance, fancy dancy jump slash thing across here? Missed. That spider is really messing up my targeting strat here. Uh oh, that's not good. All right. Itch. Hmm. So now, I think I can pull off a bomb throw to the switch. Too early. early. Last one was too late. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh, that permanently opened those doors. Oh, okay. That's good, I guess. That opened both sides. Yes, it did. All right. So I need to hit that switch again to get inside here with this box. <clears throat> we have a plan. All right, we need to get rid of this guy so he doesn't fork us on the way. All right, nice. Be careful, because we can get hit by that. This opens those gates. So let's hit that, grab the box, and go inside. Nice. And then we can put it on the blue switch. Heck yeah. What does this do? Oh, it opens that door. God. Ah, come on. Why? Thank you. All right, save it. We've been in both those rooms. Oh, now getting out is going to be a problem again. Okay. We need to do a fancy dancy uh, jump slash thing across here. It's a little bit easier this time, probably because the spider's gone. Hey! Nice. <laughs> I have no idea if that's what I'm supposed to be doing to get there, but. Uh, now I just need to go the right way so I can get to that door. I think it's this way. Yeah, 
what's over here? Hopefully, uh, we can do this. All right, we're not ahead of ourselves. Oh my god. Oh, there's a key door there. That's not good. Really, dude? Frick off. Where did he go? Oh my god. Two hearts? Are you freaking kidding me? Since when do they jump over you like that? Wow. That was insane. All right, well, I'm going to run into a problem here immediately because I don't have a key. Unless, well, no, there's no chest in here, so that's a problem. All right, so I was too early to that. Too early to that party, which means I do the crate BS again. You know, I'm probably just gonna reload because I had, I had full hearts before I went in there. I have a feeling that there's stuff we need to do at the bottom. Ow. Oh, that's great. So we gotta fend off those guys and blue bubbles at the same time. All right, there's a chest down here. I'll bet this one has the key. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Alright, let's be careful because, wow, this is a lot of redeads. And they do freeze you. I need you all to just kind of go back to your peaceful whatever you're doing. Redead Bonanza. Nice. Took out most of them. Nice. Alright, does that make a chest up here? We had dungeon map and compass, so it has to be either a key item, like the slingshot, which I, I think it's going to be a slingshot. I, we need a slingshot soon, because we've been seeing eye switches that we can't hit, and we need a key as well. We need two keys because we've seen two key. Oh, wow. So that did not trigger that chest. All right. So there must be something else that triggers that. Oh, my gosh. What's with the line of rupees up there? Huh. Uh, this is the room with, like, the three different holes you can fall down. All right. And that one has a line of rupees. That's actually kind of fun. Um, all right, so we came in through that one. Let's go this way. It's gotta be like something to turn on the chest. All right. Kill everything that we come across, I guess. I'll bet this one's hiding the switch. Or I could be wrong. switch. Maybe you have to kill every single enemy, including the bu blue bubbles. One. Oh boy. Get. the wall with you. Alright. Hear them over this way. Hello. This one's bobbing up and down uh, pretty crazy. Yeah, I think that's going to Alright. 
Oh, there's a switch there. That probably triggers the chest. But, uh. Ow! <sighs> wow, okay. So that was kind of a waste of time. We need a key. And that locks behind us. Yeah, nice. Okay. Where else can we go? That's still blocked. That's locked behind a key. Ooh, got the jump slash on him. What? Run out of ideas here. Let's open the middle again. So we get that switch, we need to go down there. Which is the problem. slingshot so I'm wondering if we can't do anything in here until we even have a slingshot now I'm thinking we're here too early I feel like that switch would open up the middle drop down get the chest but where's all the keys at Now, there's also a switch up there. That looks like it's already triggered, which is kind of weird. Now, I wonder if I can throw a bomb and hit that from here. Close to the edge, can I get? Alright, so I feel like that's not doing anything for that switch. But there is this switch poking out of the wall here. I bet this just opens this gate. Unless it opens the middle too. No, it does not. It opens all those. Weird. No benefit of jumping on there. Now it's funny that those doors closed again. Good at consistently getting that. Man, there's no way to hit that switch either without a bomb, which is super annoying, because if you run out of bombs, you're screwed. And these pots don't give bombs again. There's pots in here. I wonder if these give bombs. Well, you could fall down this hole. If you got stuck. Wow. So we have a problem, and I'm thinking that we're here too early, maybe? We need a slingshot. Which makes me think that we need to somehow get into Deku Tree. Because... Deku Tree would have the slingshot. Dango's Cavern had... Bomb Bag, like it should. 
All right. So is there a way to get past all the BS in Kokiri now that I just haven't seen? Run to the forest. See what we can see. All right. See if there's anything that I'm missing in here to open that gate to get to Deku. We have three bombs. Navi is completely useless. All right, so there's no switch up there or anything, so it's not like I need to. looking to see if there's any kind of way that that gate is going to open. Hey, someone subscribed on uh, YouTube. I have my alert set up. That's pretty funny. Thanks for the sub. I missed the name. Alright, what's going on here? I feel like... There's something that can happen here that I'm not seeing. Rocks blocking the way. Unless there's not, and I'm just not knowing what to do. We already have one. What does it want us to do? Can look through there, but I don't see anything. Thank you for the bombs. Yes. More bombs! Alright. Let's go take a closer look at this gate over here. See if there's something we can't do. It's a gate, that's for sure. Is there like a switch in the water that we don't see that could potentially uh, let the gate down or up? I don't see any water switches. <sighs> Man, I don't know. Maybe Kokiri's not the answer. Lost Woods, Sacred Forest Meadow we've been to. Those ways are brutal. We still don't have Zelda's lullaby, unless there's a way to get into the castle that I have not seen yet. No ocarina stuff. We do have a little bit of nudge. Let's see if the scrub here sells anything uh, different. They did put a Gwei here, so... What do you have? Pick up more Deku sticks for 40. Sure. But we still carry 30. Oh, I got half my money back. That's pretty funny. Oh, man. So Lost Woods is kind of a dud still. Wow, that was... So Kokiri's no. A no-go. Nothing that I can see different to do here to open that gate to Deku Tree. Unless it's because we skipped Deku entirely and we don't need to go there and the slingshot's found elsewhere. Which is highly possible. 
I just don't know where else we would go. I mean, Hyrule Castle Market is not accessible. There's torches on either side, though, which is interesting. Which makes me think we need Din's Fire to even get in there. Then how the heck would we get Zelda's Lullaby? Oh my god, really? Unless there's stuff in these grottos that normally I wouldn't care about. Only one way to find out. Money. I'm kind of stuck. Ain't no way we'd be able to bring a torch all the way over here to hit those on your side. Ah, <sighs> man, my loss. Zora's River's no go. We can't bring the cuckoo past that one spot to even cheat our way in there. Kakariko. Now we haven't tried going in any of the houses. Is this the first time you visited this village? A great woman, Impa, opened up this village to us poor folk. Wow. Interesting unskippable text there. Bring fire from Big Brother's room back here. Interesting line. This house is blocked off. So yeah, the, the piece of heart cow area is completely inaccessible. Actual bottom of the well, I don't know what that is. Wait, what do you say? Did you get the redstone? Let me get one little lick. No, boo. <laughs> so do they say different stuff now that I've fixed, well, finished it on this cavern. What about you, eh? They say that a fairy lives on top of Death Mountain. If you want to make it to the top, you'd better take a big shield with you. Not very helpful. Little boy isn't here right now. This is the shop that's not open. It's over the castle. Looks like it's ready to fall. <laughs> oh, I can't go behind him? Okay, guess not. What am I supposed to be doing? This is a reason why I don't care for some older ROM hacks is because it's not really clear what the frick I'm supposed to be doing and you're just wandering around for three years before you either cave and ask for advice, look up a video, or just give up entirely. There's no clear direction a lot of the times, which is very, very annoying. Granny. That's the back of that shop. This is just gonna be a useless grotto, most likely. It's gonna be money. Four bombs, though. Max out the bobs. Hey, Max here refuse again. Nice. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. I'm stuck. No slingshot, which is topping me in the bottom of the well. Well, spider house. Unless there's something I need to do here in the crater, but I highly doubt it. Oh wow, it's the bottom of the rock here. I don't have much time though. Two pieces. 
Probably safer just to. Oh my! Well, actually, that uh, works out in my favor. I think. Yes, it does. All right, no scrub down here. I actually kind of want him to grab me again, or just jump down here and zone it. Cause... Doubt there's anything over here. I'm gonna run out of time. It'd be funny if there's a chest in there. We're gonna die! Nice. Alright, well, I think that's enough scratching our heads for one session. I'm stuck. So if you guys enjoyed the video, me running around trying to figure out what the heck I'm supposed to be, make sure you drop a comment, tell me what you think, subscribe to see more of this if I ever figure out where the heck I'm supposed to go, and I will catch you in the next video. Until then, take care.